newly married Alex has gotten two kisses going on by fighters tonight. So. Oh, that, that is true. Yeah. I think that's why he's so excited. <laughs> the strong style guys like to blow me kisses. I don't know what it is. Alex is seeing everything early. Establishing center. No surprise there, being the much larger guy. And I like the karate bounce that Dom has. He's gonna, if he's gonna land a takedown or any strikes, he's gonna have to just be in and out the whole time. Yeah. Would like to have seen him set that up a little bit better, but Dang, nice it was snap. effective. And now he's on top. He's potentially gonna be a little heavier, uh, not having to cut as much weight as Walter's attempt, or thought that he would have to, so he might have came in a little near. Taking away all those size disadvantages, reach, height, all that by you know, bringing the fight to the floor. Yeah, I was wondering where he'd take this fight. And, uh, he got it to the ground effortlessly. Yeah, he. Uh, this happened in their amateur fight too. He was able to ground him a couple times. Walter did a good job using that long frame, using the fence, getting back to space, and uh, ultimately doing more damage. But as you can see, who, who has more answers from that first fight? Yeah. It's just like Dom just snapping him down. Very fundamental. And how big would it be taking this fight on a short notice? A rematch. Get him down. Big takedown by Scotty. Uh, for Dom to come back and get a win. Uh, his first pro win versus the guy that he lost a belt opportunity to. That would be pretty cool. Absolutely. Yeah, I'm glad that he took the opportunity. Not only because we have another, you know, we're able to save a fight on this card, but it, it's very cool to see them rematch. I like to see that when guys get that second opportunity at the next level, because there's a lot more things uh, at your disposal. Sasevain has shown that he's a pretty good ground guy, and uh, he's just going to be able to have a lot of weight on Dom this time around compared to his other opponent that he had. Yeah, he's going to be able to bully him a little bit more. I mean, we spoke at length about, you know, the, uh, the frame, the size advantage. And, uh, I mean, it's apparent, just looking at the two of them, that you know, he should be able to have his way physically if, uh, if he chooses to keep the fight here. Just shoving that head into his neck. Size of vein, not a comfortable position. Yeah, he's putting a lot of weight on his upper body here toward the, the face, like you said, making it hard to breathe. Not doing much to pass, really kind of biting his time. And he settles into a half guard position, but Don doing a good job keeping those legs extended. And uh, maybe we can see this fight get back to neutral. Nope. Ooh, he closes down that half guard. Excellent job to not just settle for guard. But with him being a much longer guy, there's not as much threat no. from the bottom guy in, in John. So you might be able to get more effective ground and pound, to be honest, if he were to just stay in guard. He's trying to get those knees in there, create that space. Uh, or he's trying to hip out. It's such, it's such a hard say. thing to do just with Walter being so wide. Yeah. Yeah. But he got his hips under him there. And then decided to go up rather than in. Turns it into a front headlock. Good job. Oh, that's pretty deep, too. Oh, my Walter gosh. Walter needs to roll here. He needs to have some urgency. It's under. There are some guillotine wins to Dom John's credit. And the, the grip yeah. is broken. But he does use it to sweep and to get on top. Yeah, that could save him this round if he if he can hold position and kind of be a little dominant here. Yeah, he's got a minute to work here. He can definitely steal this round if he does some damage. I like what I'm seeing out of Dom Johns. He, he, there wasn't much for him to do when Walter's so big and has him up against the cage on the bottom, and he just found his one opportunity to sneak out. And he's still threatening that choke, which uh, is keeping Walter from turning in and, uh, and getting that wizard that could get him back to his feet. I think so. that's how he finished Kyle Crum. Yes, it was. Yep. Solid opening round. Yeah. And Dom Johns taking it on short notice. A lot of people are surprised here in Cleveland. 
Um, not that Walter looked bad at all. Actually, that was a good round for Walter uh, compared to Brown. Took this fight on one week notice. Now we're five minutes in, and let's see if uh, we can see those three S's. He arguably, yeah, I want to see Scotty strike. Um, Dom arguably won that first round. A very close round. Absolutely. Now he's staying incredibly low. He's He's fainting the takedown, which I love. Yeah, he's showing it almost too much here. Not a lot of offense that he can uh, throw, you know, strike-wise, being that low. Uh, so he's making making no secret of what he's trying to do there. But uh, it didn't it didn't matter. Yeah. I was gonna say, size of veins. Uh, lateral movement was really good, and that's a good way to defend those takedowns just by moving. Uh, your feet, but Adam is just relentless for getting it to the ground. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I, I believe you played Alex, uh, played football, Alex. Low man wins. I mean, yeah, you're seeing that from Dom here. It's huge because the center of gravity is just much more balanced. It's much lower than uh, than a guy like Walt, who's kind of got to you know deal with. Yes, I'm tall. I'm going to be longer. I'm going to be taller, but I got to deal with a little more balance. Yeah, which having that that frame, those long limbs, helps uh, defending takedowns against the cage. But if you can get him out in space um, and not uh, let him establish that frame, then you can get a lot of success getting in on those legs, which we've seen Dom do multiple times here. I'd like to see Dom just maybe try to jump to the side. I know it's hard because there's long legs of Scotty, but... Yeah, he uh, doesn't seem, I mean, the, the guard's closed right now with Walter, so we're not seeing a whole lot of effort from him. He's opening up his hips now to potentially wall walk. But, yeah, Dom should definitely put more weight into him. Oh, uh, he gave him some space, and Walter took advantage. Excellent job to explode up here. Maybe see that snap takedown again by Dom if he can get it. Oh, switches, switches to single, single. Head inside. And this is where that That's frame comes That's a good scroll by Walter. He's going to throw some heavy body shots. Just getting those hips back is huge for Scotty this time. Dom's hiding the head a little better here. Walter, Walter's maybe sensing the fatigue. Yes. In Dom Johns. And uh, he's not letting him off the hook. That's for sure. Oh, he's got good wrist control. And... Uh, yeah, he's got that tight waist, traditional wrestling stuff here. It's peppering in some uh, some right hands. Dom doing a good job of continuing to fight to his feet, and yeah. he's going to take the back here. Tactical error there from Scotty. He, uh, he got back to his feet. I'd like to see a front kick up the middle here from Scotty. Yeah, or the knee. What's that? Like to see some elbows from this half guard position. Heavy shots from Walter. Yeah, that was just that was Dom very odd. I wonder if something happened to Dom. Maybe yeah. he tweaked an ankle or he's something. Because he just kind of fell and he's almost That's lost it. his fighting spirit. That's it. That's it. Walter Sai Scotty Savary gets it done in Cleveland, Ohio.